Hey everyone, Guard here, and today I'm doing a little mud dabbering, or daubering, however you want to say it, uh, mitigation, <laughs> keep them from coming in. There's those little bugs, they don't, you gotta get so close. It's not real close. Oh, okay. <laughs> ah, sorry about that camera person. That's more, uh, she's pretty it's good. It's really. But anyway. So, Come over here and look. That's okay, I believe you. <laughs> so anyway, they, they like to get in these little holes and build nests and stuff and go in there and lay their mud down. So I bought this kit, it was on Amazon. It had this one, this one, and two small round ones to go in the furnace on the intake and the exhaust of the furnace. And um, I think it was aluminum, it's, it's steel. But anyway, it's, it's thin. A lot of them were thicker. This one was, wasn't quite as thick. So it didn't stick out as far. It's got this little gasket to put around there. I start it in the middle, work my way around. And then it's got these little springs. And the springs, it's round, it's open on this end. And on this end, it's got a crossbar. And the crossbar is closest to the screen. It's uh, not to the screen, to the RV. The open end is close to the screen. So I'm gonna just put this in here like that, put the crossbar down, crossbar down. And the hard part is getting this little tool, it has a notch on it. You gotta get it through one of the screen holes and then through the spring and you want to catch that little notch on that crossbar. And then you just stick it up here. You line it up to where you want it to be. And you push it through. And you work that little clip in there into the hole. And get it out. So there's that one. And it's a little harder in a second one because you don't have that ability to look at it. I know that it's, boy, and my eyesight really makes this tough. There we go. All right, so. I see this was a little tool. The screens are real tight. I'm gonna try to just grab it on the thing. I can't really. There we go. Okay, come on. And did I get it? Did I get it? There we go. So it's on. And you can still open the door you could probably at that point you could probably almost uh, grab a pair of needle nose pliers mm -hmm. and pull this up and get it on there better but it's it's okay it's gonna but hold right now you can right see now. that it's on yeah yeah you can see how they came through over here yeah right there yeah okay so that's nice that job. and then uh, flip that down so I got that taken care of, and uh, I got two more round ones for the uh, furnace side. So let's go take a look at that. And this is right here also, caution, hot exhaust. Avoid prolonged exposure exhaust vent area. Do not touch vent. So don't do this when it, this is hot. Just, you know, just don't do it on, when this furnace has been running. And also, if you're, if you're running your furnace, don't open this window. Leave that window shut, because you could be getting exhaust fumes into your cabin. Or your coach or your well I'm used to saying cabin or coach into your RV your camper <laughs> Let me... nice company it says thank you for your trust we provide high quality merchandise and timely after sale service because the screen is so fine these little holes because you don't want the bugs to come in there 
just makes it a little extra difficult. But not that bad. That's perfect. There we go. I like that. The cast better. One more. It just. Another word of caution is them little wires, they can stick you pretty good. They catch on everything. Okay, so, but they didn't catch that. Okay. Tiny. Yeah. Okay, so there we go. So I got it all hooked up so I can stretch it. We're gonna put it over there. And Try to grab it right around that middle. Right around the middle. Perfect. There we go. Do not block or obstruct this appliance vent. Another good warning. Avoid prolonged exposure. Do not touch. So remember that if you got little kids or something, the furnace is going. Don't let them come up here and grab a hold of those things and play with them. They're not toys. But anyway, there it is. That's my uh, my mud dauber prevention. So they weighed. Only a couple of ounces, so a couple of ounces of prevention is worth a lot of mud curing, curing mud. Thanks for watching, everybody. Have a great day. Go out and see America. It's a wonderful place. Bye.